This is Jordan Tower with JT News. Make sure you smash that like button, smash that subscribe button. Well, what do we got today? DJ Envy is not very happy with Kevin Samuels passing. Now, a lot of women were on social media and guys, and they were trashing Kevin Samuels. I mean, this man just, he just passed, right? And the way DJ Envy said he looks at it as, hey, uh, if, you know, I didn't like you when you were alive, I don't like you when you're dead, so be it. But there's another saying, you know, there's a, there's more to it than that, because say, say somebody passes, right? And, you know, they're, they're, you don't have to say anything, you know, if you didn't like the person when they were alive, there's, you, you, you just don't have to say anything, period. You know, there's certain people that have passed that I didn't like. I, I didn't go on social media and say, yeah, good, good for them. You know, you don't want to wish that upon anybody. But if you don't care, you don't care. And I, I can totally understand that. But it seems like DJ Envy had a real problem with Kevin Samuels, probably through his wife. I, I, and I can totally understand. Um, but people are being unfair. I don't like it when people, the way people act in certain situations. Then we got Joe Budden jealous of Kendrick Lamar uh, because Kendrick Lamar can just drop when he wants and just put out a press release, leave TD. He has like a lot of freedom as an artist. And I would be jealous of him too if I was an artist because it's like he just has these freedoms that not every artist has. So a lot of artists have to play the game, you know, and, and, and do everything to appease the label when Kendrick Lamar, people like Kendrick Lamar, Drake, and J. Cole have set themselves apart from the rest. And th there's nothing to it just having a really strong fan base, which is very hard to get. It doesn't, it happens organically. You can't plan it or predict it or anything. It just, it just happens the way it happens. Um, Drake probably will be dropping this year. I mean, there's been a lot of rumbles that he's working on another album. He dropped last year, and it was cool. But I believe that he's definitely going to drop this year, especially with Kendrick coming. Kendrick kind of waited out J. Cole and Drake. They both dropped last year, and now Kendrick's going to drop. And I think Drake will drop either during the summer or in the beginning of the fall. Uh, because he is working on a project and he's staying on features. He's not disappearing. He's not taking time off right now. He's keeping the pressure on. So I would assume he's probably going to drop again in the next six months for sure. Um, we'll have to see. Um, anyways, that's all that's going on right now. Keep you guys up to date. This is George Tower with JT News. Make sure you smash that like button. Smash that subscribe button. I'll check you guys on the next one. Peace.